lifestyle life. Big it up! So surfing is actually a very safe sport. It, it teach you to work with people, it work in teams, it teach you about respect. So you have to learn to respect the ocean, you have to learn to respect nature, and you have to learn to respect yourself. What was your favorite college lifestyle moment? It was the episode with Jay Will. He's personally my favorite film director. From the stoplight to the spotlight, mostly. Come again. Come back, you go and tell your friends. This is Jay Will. Am I looking to camera? I use college to get into CBS, use CBS to get into MTV. While I was at MTV, I was working in um, MTV Home Video. Move from MTV Home Video to MTV Production, working at MTV News, then work at MTV Two, still within MTV. Moved up from editor to associate producer. Did an EPK for Kanye, and that's how I met Casey Jackie. Casey Jackie, met him at MTV, and then that's how I did my first dance hall project. Let me just get up here and get comfortable with it. God, I am Ross Casa and I don't know why I'm sitting on this chair on top of this chop. You are watching college lifestyle. God, I'm waiting till the shine wears off. Cut, cut, sorry, sorry, sorry. Hi, I'm Ross Casa, you're watching college lifestyle. This is like the craziest interview ever. It's the greatest job you can ever have, being a filmmaker. It starts with a dream, but you have to have the determination to live it. We're going to talk to some Jamaicans who are making some serious waves in the fashion industry up here in New York. No matter if you're drop dead gorgeous or you're very talented, if you don't believe in yourself and if you don't believe that you have a purpose to do something, no one can make it happen for you. You have to really, really make it happen for yourself. What I would say for an aspiring model, especially coming out of Jamaica, is just like sticking to your morals, sticking to your values understanding your worth, um, have a close relationship with your booker and your agent and I mean that's always just going to make your life so much easier and not get caught up in the whole hype. To so all the girls who are looking to get into modeling, my advice to you is to stay in school, get your education, um, go as far as you can because um, you know the time span in this world it's very limited and it's kind of not your, you're not the deciding factor here, like it, if everything is decided by the industry you know it's what they want at what given time and it is fashion you know like your product you're you're selling your product you're you're selling your body and your body's not going to stay the same forever so it's good to get an education what keeps you coming back to college lifestyle week after week the good stuff you guys show you got the pink shoes dude that, 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 that don't kill me. people need to understand that a college education is not only about textbooks classrooms and exams it's about the social experiences that you get on campus and the people that you meet from all over the world and the photo club and the jazz club and the, the guitar club and I think the stress of a university environment is the perfect place to test your skills you know to see how much you can take how much you can't and how to learn how to take more and more and more I'm Captain Siobhan Smith I'm the to Jimmy Walsh and we're both from the Jamaica Defense Force Airwing and this, this is, is how we live, live our, our college, college lifestyle, lifestyle. You know what fly, you know what fly, you know what we were sent on a mission in just the most awful weather where we heard that the gorge had just flooded out completely. And I mean, even for me, first time getting in there, I just was amazed at how much water was flowing through that Bagua gorge. By the end of the day, we had two aircraft flying in the strict confines of the gorge, two large helicopters, and we had rescued, lifted out 56 people who were stranded inside that gorge. We were lifting people off of tops of cars, people perched on the sides of hills. It was some treacherous flying, but every single time you saw somebody come into that aircraft and you saw the relief on their face, when they knew they were gonna get out safely, it just made it all easier. It's just one of those things where you're on the edge of your seat, you're nervous, you're happy, you're glad, you know that you're doing your job, you're being professional, and at the end of it, you just realize that, hey, I have the coolest job in the world. College Lifestyle featured a number of interesting personalities. Stay tuned to see who made the shortlist of the best of College Lifestyle. You're watching College Lifestyle, brought to you by Zip 103 FM, the official PlayStation for College Lifestyle.